And the answer is the second choice. Uh, it is also true that there's a small town in Virginia named Alta Vista, but the relevant answer is the second choice. Back in 1998, the most popular search engine was probably the search engine called Alta Vista. They certainly had the biggest web index at the time, and they also had great technology for responding to queries quickly. 1998 is the year that Google was founded, and most people probably have not heard of AltaVista today and might have had a hard time answering this quiz. And the reason for that is Google figured out a better way to do page ranking. And because of this, search engines that didn't have good ways of ranking pages, like AltaVista, quickly became irrelevant. And the algorithm that I've described is the algorithm that launched Google. It's called PageRank. And you may think the page stands for web page. The page actually stands for Larry Page, who was the co-founder with Sergey Brin of Google. So that's the algorithm that we've described. And that's what allowed Google to produce so much better search results than other search engines at the time. I hope you remember Anna Patterson from Unit 3 and are still following her advice to be polite on the web. One of the reasons AltaVista started to work so badly was because websites were not polite. They tried to find ways to game the rankings. Certainly, this is still something websites do today. And the way AltaVista ranked pages, it was very easy to game them. So the site that would be ranked first was not the best site about something, but a site that was best at gaming the rankings. So I asked Anna to explain why Google's page ranking algorithm was so important to the success of Google. So PageRank on the web was a huge step forward. Um, I'm old enough to actually remember the time that Google launched. And um, you know, its advance over AltaVista was AltaVista was very, very prone to keyword stuffing spam. So if you said a restaurant 32 times, well, you were better than a page that said restaurant twice. So PageRank came out and actually gave a measure of popularity or traffic. And therefore, the things that said restaurant twice but were awesome they wound up going to the top. Certainly things have got more complicated since then, and there's more things that go into the ranking algorithm than just what we've shown you. But that's the basic idea. And the next thing we're going to do is change our search engine to implement this algorithm.